Star FM. It is a new week and as usual, Tinokupakure Chirongwa on the spot and a award winning show that decodes lives of your favorite and not so, you know, uh, favorite personalities from all walks of life. I am excited to be joined by one of the most misunderstood, you know, prophets, you know, one whose um, prophecies have come to pass, you know, some have uh, linked him with uh, Amos from the Bible as a prophet of doom uh, because most of his prophecies are based on misfortunes, death, etc. Amongst uh, prophecies that he has uh, made is the death of AKA, a South African rapper, you know, who was uh, gunned down uh, early this year in February. Born Obey Tichafa Mukanaira he is uh, none other than South Africa based, you know, uh, uh, Zimbabwean prophet, Dr. Prophet um, Melontic Oras uh, of Melontic Oras Ministries. He shall be schooling us on how these prophecies are revealed to him, how it works, you know, his journey in the ministry and so forth. Welcome to the show, Prophet. How are you doing? I am so blessed. Um DJ Ola, and thank you so much for hosting me on air. Uh -huh. It's my pleasure. Bless you. <laughs> God bless so, you. how is South Africa? South Africa, we are doing fine in South Africa. Mm -hmm. We are under the grace of God. Yeah. Yes. And um, um, many got to know of you uh, through prophecies you have declared, which most of them, uh, you know, predict the bad things are yet to happen. We shall get into that as we progress um, okay. uh, with the interview. You are born Obey Mukanaira and based in uh, South Africa. But yes. where exactly do you come from, uh, Prophet? Um, I was born in Kutu mm -hmm. from uh, under Chief Magombeze mm -hmm. um, in the village of Mukanairi. Mm -hmm. My father was the headman. Mm -hmm. He was also the... Um, in the clan of the chiefs mm -hmm. um in that place he yeah. passed away in may mm -hmm. yeah so basically that's where i come from mm -hmm. um i did my primary school at a school called mtendeore mm -hmm. i think i saw you had the chef from here okay yes. yeah oh yes yes yeah chef from mm -hmm. is actually a, a relative to me oh yes yes mm -hmm. he is an uncle mm -hmm. he's an uncle right yeah, at some point in time, he was staying at our place. Mm -hmm. We learned at the same school, Ntendeore Primary School mm -hmm. in uh, Masuinko. Mm -hmm. Then Form 1, I once did it at, in Saka. Mm -hmm. I moved yeah, so tell me, say, I think I was here, maybe we come close to your mic. <laughs> All right. Yes. Um, they will, uh, um, you have to forgive me. My voice speech is like this. Uh -huh, okay. All right, all right. Uh -huh. Yeah, so um, I did secondary school at Tsiga Secondary in Zaka, and uh, I completed at Majada Secondary, mm -hmm. a school that is um, in my local area. Mm -hmm. Then I did my high school at Allied High School. Mm -hmm. um, from there, I moved on to the University of Zimbabwe. Mm -hmm. I did psychology. Mm -hmm. Then I also did a, 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 a postgraduate uh, diploma in education. Mm -hmm. I was once a teacher in um, Mozi. Mm -hmm. I was once a teacher in Mozi. Um, at Denda Primary School. Okay. Then I moved it to South Africa. When I moved it to South Africa, um, I worked there as a lecturer. Mm -hmm. I then studied uh, law, LLB, mm -hmm. but I've never practiced uh, practiced mm -hmm. as one mm -hmm. because that's when also God called me into uh, the prophetic office. Mm -hmm. Among us. The other um, things that I studied, I was just trying to find something that I can use in life. Mm. I also have a BBA, Bachelor of uh, Business Administration in wow. Marketing okay. by Regnes Institute. Mm -hmm. um, uh, I also have Masters. Mm -hmm. I also have uh, a PhD. 
that's why they call me doctor it's not a doctor of uh, prophecy yes. or whatever yes yes, mm -hmm. yes yes you're a real dog yes i am a real dog mm -hmm. so best um at the present moment in south africa i am running to colleges my own colleges oh in south africa yes wow if you check um even if you check on google it tells you i have um melon de chorus feather um education mm -hmm. the training fet okay it combines theology and the other training courses mm -hmm. um then i also have uh, a facility that is called uh secunda uh training college mm. secunda training college those are two okay and i am also mm. um a shareholder mm -hmm in a college called ABM College South Africa. Mm -hmm. That's where I am currently uh, stationed as one of the directors. Mm -hmm. So that's basically what I do in life. Yeah, great. And uh, yes. it's a you know, huge profile. Um, yes. Yeah. So prophet, in which category do you fall into? Um, a prophet or a preacher? Which is which? Uh, or maybe both? Um, I preach very well. Mm -hmm. Before I became a prophet, I was a very good preacher. Mm -hmm. I preached very well. Yeah. Um, number one. Number two, um, according to the definitions of the Bible mm. and what the Bible says about what qualifies a person to be a prophet mm. and how I received my You're calling. calling. You're calling, yeah. I am... A, a prophet a prophet a true one for that matter a true one yes okay we shall get into that as well yes uh i can't wait <laughs> for that question <laughs> <laughs> so would you agree with me when i say that uh, your strength is in prophecy because uh, some of your prophecies have uh, you know come to pass um let me say basically prophets is something that people who do not know me mm -hmm. Are getting to know of mm -hmm. but people who know me they have actually recognized us through healings and restoration mm. our ministry is so rich in in healing okay in south africa we have people uh, if you go to my page there are people who were testifying of mm -hmm. being healed of cancers mm -hmm. things and the like mm -hmm. not that we can we i will say i have the power to heal mm. but when God steps in, miracle happens. So to begin, uh, I mean, uh, can you take us through uh, your spiritual journey? How did it begin? Maybe in uh, in brief. All right. I think last week there is an, an interview that was done um, when they were asking my mother mm -hmm. about me. Um, let me just say I was born a prophet, mm -hmm. and if it, if there is anyone who went to school with me especially at a level mm -hmm. they can tell you that of course i was a very naughty boy um, if i can tell you that i used to drink alcohol mm -hmm. doing all those things mm -hmm. running away from school mm -hmm. but i know i have some of them watching me right yeah. now yeah. they know that it was the divinity paper when we were writing a divinity paper mm. there's a time when i called my classmates and i gave them gobets i said these gobets they are coming in our examination mm. i used to uh, um dream mm. of my results i used to dream of my ex mm. the examination that uh, that's coming, that's coming. Mm. and um one thing that i can tell you in i had my first angelic in in 1993 mm -hmm. there was a fallout between my late father and his uh, late young brother so I saw the angel of the Lord and the uh, uh, my spirit told me that this is the uh, an angel of the Lord mm. and he said to me your fathers must reconcile and reunite mm. so I spoke to my father. I spoke to both of them. Then he couldn't understand me. Like even the people whom I grew up with, most mm. of them, they, they 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 couldn't understand mm. who really I am. Mm. 
because I was that person who was born in a, a, a very unique fashion. Mm -hmm. Yes, I, I hail from a family of eight. Mm -hmm. uh, my mother had six children and she named the last one Tafazwa, meaning you are the last mm -hmm. born. She did all those contraception, to, uh, uh, but five years down the line, I came mm -hmm. into the picture. By mistake? By mistake. Mm -hmm. So it came as a shock. Even my father used to call me Mwanawa mm Utana, -hmm. meaning to say the child that came in my mm. old ages. Yes. So really, to be honest, some of the things, you know, when you tell people, um, I understand and I believe and know that you have encountered a lot of people whom you have asked. There are some people, as the Bible says, that there are people who come and speak their minds. Mm. Uh, come here, sit here for the interview. You ask me, I begin to tell you my imaginations mm. that God, this, God, this, and God whatsoever. Yeah. But one thing that I am so sure of, mm -hmm. one thing that my Father in heaven knows is that I have a constant record of interaction with the holy spirit wow so do you still remember the first uh, prophecy you did yes what was that it was in 2013 when i prophesied about <laughs> the death of uh, nelson mandela mm -hmm. <laughs> about nelson mandela yes that was the first prophecy that was the first prophecy so uh, from 1993 you were not prophesying no uh, you were just seeing things and uh, uh, i didn't i can't say i was prophesying because mm -hmm. to me it was some i would speak out what i am seeing mm -hmm. not knowing that there is a grace oh. of being uh, uh, uh yes what happened during that uh, you know prophecy yeah yeah baba mandela the prophet what happened uh, um okay let me just explain how uh, i see things usually um when i see a person when i see things i think most people who have come to church they can tell you this mm -hmm. um the lord gave me the gift of time traveling mm -hmm. i can travel to the month of december and see what will happen mm. okay i can travel um, all those things mm -hmm. that's why you see when i write prophecies mm -hmm. i actually stipulate that this thing won't exceed 90 days mm -hmm. meaning to say it might happen tomorrow two weeks or what but 90 days mm -hmm. it won't surpass that but is it is not accurate all right let me say this let me say this um you are given a question paper mm -hmm. out of 50. Huh? Mm -hmm. using guesswork Will you make a total out of it? <laughs> I just want to. Will you make a total out of it? <laughs> I don't. I don't know. You don't know. Yeah. All well. right. Let me give you, for example, if it's guesswork, uh, let me stand to be mm -hmm. corrected. If it's guesswork, last month I went to my Facebook mm -hmm. page. I wrote that in Boxback there will be an explosion. Mm. Huh? Then the following day, the Holy Spirit also showed me. An explosion in Johannesburg CBD. Mm -hmm. I wrote again on my Facebook that there will be another explosion in GP. Mm -hmm. In Boxbeck, the explosion was on Friday. Mm -hmm. In GP, the explosion also followed the following mm -hmm. Friday. Mm -hmm. So that's number one. Number two, th there's a prophet that m I made that mm -hmm. made everyone to know me about. Yeah. Um. I made a prophecy, the first, first ever prophecy that made people in Zimbabwe to know me. A prophecy that I wrote that on a Wednesday, there's a certain person who could be passing away in Zimbabwe on a mm -hmm. Wednesday, a cloud Wednesday, mm -hmm. and the person will also be buried on a cloud Wednesday. The person works this and that, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, you that prophet that prophet came to pass mm. yeah most of your prophecies you know uh i don't know that 
that is why we called you uh, to come uh, so uh, did your spiritual journey start in South Africa or you moved that side um, what happened is I went to South Africa when I went to South Africa I was a person okay I knew that I have a gift of mm-hmm. dreaming and seeing vision things that they like mm-hmm. but um, I wasn't in ministry or whatsoever it so happened in 2010 when my brother passed away. Mm-hmm. We were attending the funeral 20 August 2010. Mm-hmm. I was sleeping in the council of the elders there. Mm-hmm. So I sleep walked. Uh, just went to the place where the elders were sleeping took some fire, went to the mountain, mm-hmm. sleepwalking. I was driven actually by the spirit mm. of God. Then I was told that you are going to be a prophet. Mm-hmm. You shall heal the sick. You shall prophesy. And you are going, and I want you to quote this, mm. you shall move in the spirit of the biblical Old Testament Amos and Jeremiah, Mm -hmm. which is restoration and doom. Mm. But yes, I am a doom prophet. I know Mm. you you have seen people saying you're a doom prophet, and I say yes. (laughs) Yes, I'm a prophet of doom Mm -hmm. because where is the doom? Mm -hmm. Where there is injustice, Mm -hmm. whether it's at a workplace, Mm -hmm. whether if God says, speak about it, mm-hmm. I talk about it. So you admit that you're, you're, you're just a prophet of doom. And restoration. And restoration. Yes. Okay. So what is the re- what was the reason for you maybe to, uh, mag- I mean, migrating to South Africa? Um, as I said, when I, I, I moved to South Africa, mm-hmm. uh, I moved to go and look for a job. Mm-hmm. Of which I went and started working as a lecturer. Mm, okay. That was 2000 and uh, I worked in 2009. Okay. As a lecturer mm-hmm. at a uh, college called uh, PTA, mm-hmm. Pretoria Technical uh, University uh, College. Uh-huh. So, Prophet, how does the name Melontic Oras, you know, come by, and what does it mean? Melontic Oras. This is a Greek. It's a Greek name. Mm-hmm. Uh, 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 when translated to English, it means future eye- eyesight or seeing in the future. Okay. Yes. Mm. Mm. So, uh, wha- so you just give yourself that name, or it's not me. Mm-hmm. Who gave you the name? It is the church. Actually, when I am in church, mm. they can attest to that. You can hear people now calling me Chigrinedi. Mm-hmm. You can hear people calling me. Uh, um, uh, it's all it's, it's the way they appreciate mm. their prophet. They call oh, okay. me names. Sometimes I'm changing now. Yes. So yes, it's yes. it's just ch- is it that a good change, but it's not on your uh, um, uh, identification. Uh, you know, my um, particular age. It's, it's on my identification. You 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 later changed your real name to this one on your uh, particulars. Yes. It's okay. On my identification. Mm. Why then did you uh, change those? You know. Um. What happened is. When I was in South Africa, Mm -hmm. there are some companies Mm -hmm. that I registered using that name, Melon Chorus. Okay. For example, if any of you check on Google, Mm -hmm. if you go and and, and, uh, Google Melon Chorus Mm -hmm. Private Mm -hmm. Limited. Oh, yeah. Yes. So um, when I wanted to, uh, because. uh, I had some shares with other people. Mm-hmm. There is what they call BBE, yeah. where you need to include the locals. Mm-hmm. So there's a person, a person who was there, sold out. Mm-hmm. So when I was uh, left as a, a sole guarantor mm-hmm. of the car company, um, the documentation that I was using, mm-hmm. um, they needed to tally. Oh. So I in, I had to go through that that that, that, that process where mm-hmm. you do have David and all you, that. Yes, yes. Uh, just to remind our listeners that I'm talking to uh, Prophet uh, Mer, um, Melontic Oras. I want to know, Panaba, Vajinji Munamazia, Mukuporofita, 
zvino sirisa zvino chikisa zvine rufuru mukati and ba admit kuti yeah that's very true ndoko vakatungwa ndo basa ravo ra vanoita iro rori kupofita zvakadaro bozi vakapuwa that revelation ya chidzoserwa eh muchiprophet chaive komunguva ye old testament kuna na prophet amos nevamwe vakadaro so we want to dive deep into you know your prophecies um a prophet yeah. why is it most of your prophecies uh, in fact 99 um percent <laughs> of them uh, you predict bad things yes so you said you are a prophet doom but of, of doom but apana here zvimwe zvamunonga kuti prophet was zvimwe zviri zve doom but zvichito iwo zvichito come to pass all right um before i answer you mm-hmm. um my prophecies are balanced but it's only that uh, i don't know maybe it's god mm-hmm. who does that who makes people concentrate a lot on the negative prophecies mm. Mm. Uh, um, my prophecies are balanced a lot mm-hmm. there are sometimes even the world cup mm-hmm. of, uh, when uh, friends won mm-hmm. i actually wrote about that all mm-hmm. those things even the football i uh, i write ev- about almost mm-hmm. everything yeah even if the country is having a bamba harvest mm-hmm. i come out and say it mm-hmm. and like recently i told the people of zimbabwe mm-hmm. that the lord told me that this season this just this season mm-hmm. after the elections that we are going into mm-hmm. we need to let us work with whoever is declared <laughs> a winner by the system <laughs> because the lord is about to prosper zimbabwe mm-hmm. And that's no secret. I'm saying it on air today. You are saying it on air, but you know, you know, know people just say the same thing, uh, but they don't really s- say exactly, you know, what's going to happen after that. Yeah, they just say, okay, let's just work together. It's going to, we're going to prosper. This and that. You know, that's what most of the prophets are just saying. Um, how um, is your prophet? Uh, your prophet? Okay, let, let me say this. From those, uh, let, 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 let me say this, uh, Ola. Yeah. Um, I am a person who doesn't mind um, what the other person mm-hmm. is saying. Yeah, yeah. But one thing that I want to say to everyone who's listening to me mm-hmm. is um, later we need to stop being a toxic nation. Mm-hmm. Where if something doesn't go the way we like, mm-hmm. we become saboteurs. Mm-hmm that's not nation building mm. that's no, no, not nation building what i just want to say today is working together mm-hmm. this nation will go very far mm-hmm. we have everything the minerals we are better than botswana but we are behind why because we have created a system in our lives mm-hmm. where we sabotage each other's efforts for personal gains mm. that's not the way to go but you're, you're just giving us you know um i would say proverbs <laughs> but anyways uh, mm, we'll get uh into that. okay what i want to say yeah. i am not a person i don't really to be honest i think mm. the church knows mm-hmm. i don't like politics yeah i'm not a politician yes and i uh usually i try a lot to distance myself from, from politics from professing things about mm. the the politics mm-hmm. i know a lot of things mm-hmm. i have the ability of entering meetings yeah meetings of different parties i can yeah. enter and, and, and say this this and that mm-hmm. is happening yeah but i don't like it mm-hmm. i don't I, I just don't i'm not a, a a person who's in politics. In politics, yeah. The reason why I asked you this because it's you. It's because of you. You've mentioned something about you know to do with uh, the election season uh, that we are in and the after you know month of the election. The what's going to happen after the the election? So you know people will be eager to know who the winner is. But anyways, I will not um, you know go into that. I'm going to list some of your prophecies you have made. Um, a male character who is. Um, I, I caught this one. A male character who is a yesteryear entertainer resting shortly. And we lost Diva Mafunga. Again, on the 6th of uh, October 2022, you brought it up and uh, said prayers needed for a yesteryear gospel artist. Um, a Zimbabwean gospel artist. Was it him or you were referring to, or maybe it was someone else? Was it Diva or it's someone here to come? Um... <coughs> It's only so, some of the things. It's, it's it's only that I cannot 
say uh, 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 this because he's not is no more is yep. no longer here mm -hmm. but um there's one time when i met him coming mm -hmm. from um Light on Colomy Studios. Mm -hmm. When you met uh, Diva Mafung. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I told him that you need to be vigilant and prayerful. Mm -hmm. The enemy wants to steal your life mm -hmm. through an accident. Mm -hmm. So it's like, the thing is like people, uh, uh, like everyone, mm -hmm. if I tell someone things like this, mm -hmm. people, they don't, they don't actually they don't take you seriously. Seriously. Okay. For example, let me take you to the prophets, uh, to the story of AKA. Mm -hmm. I reached AKA on Instagram. Mm -hmm. He WhatsApped me. He called me. I spoke to him. I said to him, my brother, there are forces that are hunting you mm. and they are going to kill you. Mm. Please, disassociate yourself with this and that mm -hmm. give your life to christ mm -hmm. he said i'm going to church i said going to church doesn't clear us from our 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 the enemies and, and stuff. our dark, dark, darkness dark background mm. so after that he went to a podcast and he said there is a zimbabwean prophet who's prophesying about death mm. he's not from god mm. God is love. And he must keep those things to mm -hmm. himself, dreams and prophecies to himself. Mm -hmm. And there was a huge backlash on, mm. on, on, on social media. If yep. you can see every, almost every South African media house mm -hmm. was talking about it. Yeah, Melon chorus this, Melon chorus this, Melon mm -hmm. chorus this. Then it so happened mm -hmm. that when he went when he, he went to Deben, I also advised him mm -hmm. about it. Mm -hmm. And he didn't listen. Mm -hmm. He went on and he perished. You know what's, what happens sometimes? Uh, yeah. When such things, you know, uh, happen, mm -hmm. uh, the blame again uh, comes back to you. To say, no, no, if Mimi prophet, Mimi Dima Konze, is waiting to fulfill your prophecies. You know, that's... Um, another way of seeing it then some will say probably like mm. maybe maybe prophet dima unganza magenga you know maybe mm. maybe that's another way of seeing it you know um you know um uh, 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 so when you say let's pray, mm -hmm. For example, you, 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 mentioned, you, you mentioned about uh, Diva Mafunga, you know, you, you reached out, Magataura and whatnot. Then you told him about uh, the accident, but it so happened. Mm. Um, what happened? I'm not going to say that I'm not about that problem. Kundi so, Prophet. Right, you know, it can be a prophet is released. Mm to redeem a prof a prophet is re is released mm -hmm. to save lives saka ndikangoya pana hapa ndikataura ndikati ola one or two things are go uh, needs prayer so that they won't happen cha uno fanu kuita ndiche kuti uzina matire mhm as tombo dika na kuti ndi ndive picture okay Yes, then this thing is a two sided. Mm -hmm. uh, also, the negative world mm -hmm. is using this. Mm -hmm. The negative world can use a clause relative to you. Mm -hmm. Auto under water accident. Mm -hmm. So, the moment you know under water accident, he has planted a prophet. Mm -hmm. And once you, you regard it as a prophecy, mm -hmm. you are wait, waiting for its fulfillment. Mm. So, 
these things, it's a twofold. Yeah. So usually, they, I actually reached out and I, I want and Taura mm -hmm. uh, There is a time you are not Taura. By the time you get a prophet, you are soldier love. Mm -hmm. Yes, I think if you remember, if you have heard about those okay. prophecies, mm -hmm. yeah, I told you what he told me. It was long back. I used to write my, my names. Yes, until my leader saw Arim Chinamatu. Vandu Zawuti, no, it is very bad because you inflict fear on mm -hmm. a person. Oh, yeah. Yes, you don't need to write like that. Mm -hmm. So, um, after the issue of social love, there is also an. Uh, Artist that a certain problem. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She reached out and she said, I thought I am ready. I can mm -hmm. pay anything so that you help me. Mm -hmm. I said, No, I need not to pay you. You need only to go before God mm -hmm. and fix one or two things. Exactly. And you don't even need to come back to me and say, I've mm -hmm. done it. As long as you have done it, mm -hmm. then it's, it is well with you. So, seven, when I go to the next one, I'm going to go to the next one. You know, some of um, my, my, my prophecies are going to go uh, mm -hmm. Some earth tremors, uh, you know, will be felt in some parts of Zimbabwe. Uh, troubled farming season about Zimbabwe. Another millionaire in Zimbabwe to perish on the road. Mm -hmm. I'm assuming this was after the, the we had uh, lost Jinimi. Uh, Zimbabwe church elderly and pioneer in faith. We will rest, <laughs> and we lost uh, Baba Guti. Yeah. So the prophecies I I've I just mentioned, uh, you penned them, you know, on your Facebook page. On the thirty first of uh, August 2022. You did your research, eh? Yeah, 2022. <laughs> 20, uh, so, Robert, uh, yes, uh, yes, yes. <laughs> if all these uh, prophecies come mm. to pass, mm. um, the ones that I was talking about, mm -hmm. the eight tremors they happened, mm -hmm. Obed Karombe passed away mm -hmm. on in a road accident, okay? Yes, mm -hmm. and um, a troubled farm, farming season. If mm -hmm. you check the farming season, mm -hmm. some they harvested and some they didn't mm. harvest. And uh, what are you aiming for when you write them on your pages? Mm. Uh, people will be like, okay, what is he trying to do? Is it the way of maybe uh, uh, conveying the message? You know what happens is when I'm given an instruction by God, mm. I just take it as it is. If I see a vision, if I don't say it out, mm -hmm. that thing troubles m oh, me. Mm -hmm. I think I've heard Jeremiah saying, there is fire that is shut in mm. my, ben, my bones. Mm. So the, a prophet that is not released is fire that is shut in your bones. Mm -hmm. So what is the process like? Um, how, you know, uh, these prophecies are revealed unto you? What's the process like? No, no, no. 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 No, He's a he's a local prophet here in Zimbabwe. He, he, he said uh, sometimes you know uh, sometime uh, back I come from Vista to the heaven. <laughs> Hola. Hola. <laughs> yeah, you're a bad boy. <laughs> Why? <laughs> <laughs> so how, how, how do you, you know, <laughs> get these prophecies? All right. Um, let me explain this. A person who really prophesies. Mm -hmm. There are several channels how prophecies come. Mm -hmm. Okay. Number one, prophecies can come in forms of visions. Mm -hmm. Number two, prophecies can be released in forms of codex mm -hmm. where you need to connect things. Mm -hmm. Then, uh, number four, ah, uh, it's, it's number three. Mm -hmm. You can uh, uh, see what are known as dotted visions mm -hmm. like you see this part appears this part appears then you have to connect to yes yes, mm. yes yes so as much as you are used uh, as a vessel to convey you know messages to people mm. um is it mandatory uh mm. so um uh, 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 I think Ola, to concentrate on negative prophecies, mm -hmm. yeah. um, I have said a lot of 
positive prophecies. And this guy is a young Papa, but in the near and the Katar. Yes. Um, but in terms mm -hmm. of, of, of telling a person, mm -hmm. they are areas where the Spirit of God tells you to warn a person. Let me explain mm -hmm. this to you. Um, do you know that for death to take your life, mm -hmm. it needs something that it accuses of mm -hmm. taking your life? Mm -hmm. Do you know that? Yeah. That's why there is post-mortem. And when they do post-mortem, there is something that they say mm -hmm. it killed a person. Yeah. So, in the same event, not everyone who dies, dies a natural, uh, uh, dies uh, 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 the death that is in its fulfillment mm -hmm. stage. Mm -hmm. Because every person, me and you, we have our appointed time that was appointed by God. Mm -hmm. But it might happen that you might die before the appointed time. Mm -hmm. That's why we call it untimely death. Mm -hmm. That's why we call it premature death. Mm -hmm. The enemy also has his own ways of attacking and taking lives. Mm -hmm. So, <coughs> most of the times, and the most of the people that I have been giving this, these are the people who are according to the dark world. Those are the people that I have been telling that change. Or else you perish. Illuminati. Yes, yes. Most of the musicians on the mm -hmm. especially South Africa. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. 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 Achi zondi chaka manji, ava mm. desperate. Mm -hmm. Achi tindrikunzi, either my daughter can out, my wife mm -hmm. must die. Mm -hmm. Then, apu wa that scenario, do paka zuye, nga ndoku zuhurai. Ega. Saka andi well, kum... So you say, you mean that's uh, the cause of his death? Takazo zuhurai, yon nichikonda? Yaka sungiri la, because wanga waida kura ya, mwa anaka na mkazi. Mm. So he treasured the wife, okay. or the child. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So three days ago, uh, you wrote on your socials. Operation Muroi Kumakova, Operation Umtakati, Emma Tute, Emma Tunen, uh, Operation Witches Must Die. <laughs> From what I've just said, uh, please help me understand. You know, we've got eight minutes to go. I've got uh, still have more questions for you. Maybe we try to uh, make a shot. All right. Mm. According to my knowledge of the Bible, mm -hmm. the Bible in Leviticus says, do not suffer a witch to live. Mm -hmm. Meaning to say, if a witch lives, you are suffering. Okay. Yes. Sagam, uh, who are we to kill? You are, to, you are not going to kill. You are not going to kill. Mm -hmm. what are we, going to do? We, we are going to the Bible again. Mm -hmm. The Bible says, witches, mm. soothsayers, mm. necromancers, they must be stoned to death. But I'm not saying we need to stone them to death. What do I just say? A prayer, a mm -hmm. correct prayer, mm -hmm. positioned against the witches, mm -hmm. it will give you very nice results. Okay. So five days ago, you wrote, said day first, approaching on South Africa uh, social media. Condolences pouring in and the rest of Africa mourning this uh, one so imminent. Um, a celebrity gone. Uh, people will look at this post and say, he said it not long. I read a random comment under ENCA News Online, a lady saying, oh my God, save our celebrities. Again, I'm asking, uh, Prophet, mm -hmm. who is this person and have you reached out to them? I have reached out to them. Mm -hmm. Yes, but uh, unfortunately, I live in South Africa. Mm -hmm. um, and most of my followers are South Africans. Mm -hmm. They are also watching me as I am speaking. Yeah. Mentioning names of people, it places you in deep jeopardy. Mm -hmm. Because they they can hunt mm -hmm. you down. Yeah. And kill you, mm -hmm. thinking that you you want to kill them. Mm -hmm. I spoke to the person. Yes. Okay. He is a... Celebrity. He's a well-known musician, mm -hmm. hip-hop artist in mm -hmm. South Africa. I spoke to him. There are things that he need to fix. So if he doesn't fix that, he's going to die? Yes. Wow. 
Yeah, it's scary. How does it make you feel when your doom prophecies uh, come to pass? Uh, it's painful. It's painful. Very painful. Please, at least, uh, you know, uh, prophecies of good news that you have conveyed uh, and uh, maybe have to come to life as well. Maybe one or two. I prophesied back in um, 2018 mm -hmm. that in Zimbabwe they shall discover minerals, mm -hmm. they shall discover oil. Mm -hmm. Yes, I prophesied about it. Mm -hmm. And those things are, are coming to light. Mm. So where does your source, uh, you know, come from? Because so, so many prophets have uh, come and gone. Uh, and we later learned that uh, we actually hosted um, someone on this platform as well, saying I have done all sorts, you know. Mm -hmm. uh, so in Mimi prophet Muri Papi, it could dark or light. You can all these things. Predict with Jedi. So, um, as far as I know, um, the Bible gave us a very simple test. Mm -hmm. The Bible said, test the spirit. Mm -hmm. A person, if a person says he prophesies, mm -hmm. how is his relationship with God? Mm -hmm. If a person is prophesied, mm -hmm. okay, if there is power that is being used in that place, mm. is it an authentic power or it is borrowed power, mm. things and the like? Most people, they sell. Mm -hmm. They sell. When you want help, they sell it. But the Bible says, gifts of the spirits were given freely and freely Sorry, we shall... Prophet, I'm going to interject. Mm. Um, maybe I just want a, a straight answer. Mm. Uh, which side are you? Uh, uh, Dark uh, or light? 100% I belong to the light. To the light. I am a son of God, 100%. How do we know that you're not using Msoro um, Magora? Msoro Magora. 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 We might go you know, what's the name? Gora. Eh, hey, Shiria, you know, she's not Fembera, you know, eh, you know, Fembera, 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 you know, you know, Fembera, 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 you know, He's killing our people, he's doing this, so he's powerful. No, he's not powerful. Mm. It's only to those who do not know the power at their disposal. Mm -hmm. They are the ones that perish. The Bible says, my people perish because of lack of knowledge. Mm. knowledge. But look, man, mm. profit, they're taking advantage. So, mm. because to not want it or too much. Just because of time. Let me, let me say this, mm -hmm. Ola. Yeah. I have been... I have gone to many countries preaching in, in many countries. Yeah, yeah. I am not talking, I don't want to speak a lot. Yeah. But what I know is people out there, mm -hmm. they are scripting prophecies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They script prophecies mm -hmm. you, they give you a form where you feel in mm -hmm. your details, yeah. your name, next of kin, everything, mm -hmm. Facebook, ho uh, hold. Mm -hmm. So what they do is there's a person. Most of them check them. They will be having a Bluetooth device in their <laughs> ears. So there's a person, a lady, yeah. a receptionist there. Mm -hmm. She's busy on the profile. Oh. So the person just say, can I prophesy? Prophesy. You are Margaret. Yes, I'm Margaret. Ah. Uh, and do you know Cecilia? Those things are being retrieved from what? Oh, from the forms that you from the forms. submitted. Yeah. My brother, let me tell you one thing. Mm -hmm. In this order, there are very few prophets. Mm -hmm. I am not saying I am... I, I, am, I, I am not saying I'm the only one mm -hmm. or whatsoever, but what I want to say, mm -hmm. check the lifestyle of a person. Mm -hmm. If you want to flound the power of God, mm -hmm. you are not from God. Yeah. God is humility. Mm -hmm. God represents hu humility. Mm. You s I am a person who is a very, very ordinary person. Mm -hmm. You go to church. I meet everyone. I yeah. pray for everyone. Mm -hmm. I help everyone. I don't charge for any service. Mm -hmm. No charge for one-on-one -on -one mm. mm. because it is the work of the father mm -hmm. i fly to different countries namibia botswana mm -hmm. 
Kenya everywhere mm. using man for my personal business mm. when I go there the offering that they give mm -hmm. does not constitute even a quarter mm -hmm. of, of, of my expenses mm. but I have gone there to save lives mm. so if that makes me a false prophet mm. I, I thank God mm. I have sometimes I drive mm -hmm. I drove from South Africa as I came here yeah I drove from South Africa to here mm -hmm. non-stop to come and preach and help people mm. using my fuel mm -hmm. my car yeah I didn't charge anyone mm -hmm. I'm not charging anyone mm -hmm. if that constitutes to be a false prophet, a false prophet mm -hmm. I am very very comfortable <laughs> to be called in that parameter prophet, and you have my five-year prophecies how does that work a five-year prophecy mm -hmm. if you want yours Conduct me tomorrow. Bring a uh, bring calendar 2024, 2025 up to 2029. To say uh, this is what you are going to do. I'm going to mark on your calendar even the dates. Uh, yes, just be, get them. Call me tomorrow. I'll come. To say this is what's going to happen. Yes. Wow. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Muruku Panzwaira, Baruka 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 Prophet, to say, and it turns a calendar. Don't mark on the up and the up and the up. They no, know, even if they are my followers who are watching, uh -huh. let them drop comments. Mm -hmm. I have been giving them prophecies on a yearly basis, mm -hmm. marking calendars, mm -hmm. telling them you are going to UK on this date, mm -hmm. and they are there. If if you are on, if you are if you are in, if you can access the comments, mm -hmm. you can see them. I've been doing this a calendar. If you bring a calendar, that's how I operate. You bring it. That's a token. It's a spiritual token. Yeah. <laughs> if you bring me uh, something, mm -hmm. you give me something. Mm -hmm. You bring me something and say, man of God. Mm -hmm tell me about this mm -hmm. that's my area of speciality yeah yes i operate with tokens mm. i tell you bring me a calendar mm. just get your calendar i'll mark it then prove me here on radio again you call mm. me and say man of god you marked the, the, this calendar mm. these days are not this the things are not happening oh yes <laughs> so i didn't know uh there's a lighter side of you uh, i came across a video of you dancing to a uh, rumba song rumba music <laughs> i'm a musician <laughs> oh you're a musician yes you do uh what music genre um gospel gospel yes oh i didn't yes. know that i didn't know um, so ap apart from serious stuff what else do you get up to um my time is so limited mm -hmm. It's so limited. My time, my time says that prayer, mm -hmm. and if you, if I am not a, at work, I will be in church. Mm -hmm. yes, yes. Okay. Yes. Work and church. Work and a church. Yes. Wow, prophet. <laughs> I see you. I'm gonna work with a banana banana. Me vuzo ya kawanda. That's my calendar. Kazara ola. To talk about prophet, my calendar. But anyways, prophet. Uh, before you go, to the one prophecy um. that's gonna happen. Ya ticha zoka futi pano pa radio. Ticha tini nika yese. Nemusu ya eight August 2023. This is what Prophet Melodic Oras say. Okay, in terms of 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 what in national prophets? Probably. Um, the national ones, my mm -hmm. brother. It's trick. Mm -hmm. Um, I will better walk out of of the studio without saying anything. Mm -hmm. it's trick. Yeah. Um, because at the present moment, if I say this. Yeah, <laughs> of which that is going to happen. <laughs> my a lot of my followers, yeah, they will desert me. Oh yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. But uh, uh, same same. Mm -hmm. so you, you said same same. Yes. Is is that a prophet? Same same. Thank you. Same same. Yes. <laughs> okay. Okay. Then uh, apart from national ones. Apart from national ones. Yeah. Like but there's something that you can come back here and say, okay, this is what Prophet said that day. Okay, it's, it's very simple. Mm -hmm. 2024, mm -hmm. there's a famine that is coming. A famine? Famine, famine. That is coming? That poor rainfall. Mm -hmm. Yes. In Zimbabwe? Yes. And also, this very year, mm -hmm. this very year, there will be wild, uh, widespread floods. Mm -hmm. Mozambique, mm -hmm. Zimbabwe, Swaziland, mm -hmm. South Africa. Some people will be even swept in the houses they are sleeping. Or oh, I'm this I, year. I'm talking about I'm I'm back to doom prophecies again. Mm -hmm. Yes. This year. And this very year. You no, year the yes. This, okay, this let me say this rain season. Uh -huh. There will be widespread deaths. Mm -hmm. 
and also there's a season that is coming upon Zimbabwe, mm-hmm. a season of very painful uh, accidents on mm-hmm. the roads. Mm-hmm. Very pain, painful in such an extent that some of them will be uh, uh, made national mm-hmm. disasters. Mm-hmm. We need to pray about this. This year? This very year. Mm-hmm. It won't finish before you see this. Mm-hmm. They will be following each other. Accidents, mm-hmm. bus accidents, mm-hmm. head-on collisions, mm-hmm. bus, buses going and rolling on mm-hmm. the side. I mm-hmm. even have the names of the buses, but we can't do that for... Uh, uh, um, mm. Um, ethnic purposes. Okay. Yes. Wow. Thank you so much, uh, Prophet uh, Melantic, for coming through. And uh, how can people get in touch with you? Um, I think my numbers are everywhere on on social media. media. Mm-hmm. I am an accessible person. Everyone can call me in time. Mm-hmm. That's also my different from uh, other prophet, uh, other prophets. Other prophets. Mm-hmm. Me, I'm accessible. Anyone can call me at any time. Mm-hmm. You can reach out to me. Ask for prayers. I can pray for you mm-hmm. and see speed answers upon your life. Hans Nevan Toda Kundi so prophet is a matter of Rodichki Sanzara Tofa Zewan. One hour do fear Mumigwagba. Toda Kundi so prophet. Why was you go tower? But you see a Tataka Yenga. No, but if Kaisa Kundi so Yajo, eh, Martin Rudas was later come to pass. Cutting the one in Zara Tosu Tower from there. I'm a tough one in Zara, prophet. Ah, prophet, my dad, doom to that doom to just yes. <laughs> Thank you so much, prophet. All right, for coming. God bless you. God bless you. Prophet uh, Melodic Oras, all the way from South Africa. You came for this interview uh, with Tim Bonzo. So, I guys, you can check out this interview even on YouTube, on Facebook. Inenge Iripo, Muchinzu, Gabajitara, Nyaya, Zawa, Zatara, Nao, Panaba. Thank you so much for watching. My name is DJ Ola7 Owen We Kwamadondo. To all our listeners at home, thank you so much, guys. Uh, you can follow me on Instagram at DJ all the seven Facebook page DJ all the seven star FM in my YouTube channel at DJ all the seven Belinda Gomo is on standby with the news